हेलो फ्रेंड्स यू आर मोस्ट वेलकम इन माय यूट्यूब चैनल वाइल्ड लूप रोबोटिक एंड ऑटोमेशन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न एप्लीकेशंस ऑफ ए पी रोम इन आरडीनो ए पी रोम इज यूजफुल टू कीप डेटा व्हेन द आरडीनो रिसेट्स आर व्हेन पावर इज रिमूव्ड इन केस ऑफ माय एप्लीकेशन इट विल रिमेंबर द वैल्यू ऑफ लास्ट एल स्टेट वेरिएबल लेटेस्ट स्टार्ट आई हैव ऑलरेडी क्रिएटेड स्कीमेटिक डायग्राम Here I am using two switch. One switch is connected to D D two, and another switch is connected to D three, and LED is connected to D eight pin. When I will press the switch one, then LED will be turn on. When I will press the switch two, then LED will be turn off. If LED is turn on condition, then I will remove the power or reset the board and power came back again then led will keep maintain turn on if led is turn off condition and power removed or reset the board when power came back then led will keep remain turn off we will see arduino programming first of all i will define pin led it is connected to d8 pin it is connected to d3 pin okay first of all i am creating code without ap rom led is output button button of pin is input and button on pin is input okay i will create a variable button of state it will store the value of button of pin digital read button off okay and again button on state it will store the value of button on pin okay here i will create a if condition if button on state equal to equal to high then digital right then led will be turn off uh, sorry turn on so high so high i will create another if condition i will copy this and paste here if button of state 
इज इक्वल टू है देन देन एल ई डी विल बी टर्न ऑफ सो लो ओके नाउ आई विल सेलेक्ट दी बोर्ड हियर इज आर डीनो नैनो ओल्ड बुट लोडर कंपोर्ड नाइनटीन ओके आई विल कंपाइल एंड अपलोड uploading done so i will press here the button one not working so what's problem sir here is wrong pin number here is 3 and here is 2 i will again compile and upload Now we'll press the switch one. You can see LED is turn on and turn off. I'll press the reset button again. It's not remember the last value of LED. So I will use here EP ROM. when led will be turn on then i will update ep rom ep rom dot update here i will pass address register address and then value value i will store tier 1 and when led will be turn off then i will update here i will pass here the register address and value will be zero okay here i will create a variable it will be boolean लेडी स्टेट इक्वल टू बाई डिफॉल्ट लो इन वाइट सेटअप लू आई विल रीड इपी रोम डॉट रीड जीरो एड्रेस एंड इट विल रिटर्न इन टू एल state variable and here i will write led led state if led state will be high then led will be high by default otherwise if led state will be low then led will be turn off Okay I hope you understood this Now I will explain once again 
if turn on button will be pressed then button on state will be high so if button on state will be high then led will be turn on if led will be turn on then one will be stored in ep rom if ep rom is stored one in this condition if power will be turn off and power again turn on then here it will be read ep rom so it will be one because last time LED update was one, so here LED will be high by default. I will compile and upload. Okay, I will press this button. LED is turn on and LED is turn off. Turn on condition. I will reset the board. You can see LED keep maintain on. Once again, off condition on and off. I will reset the board. LED will not turn on. on condition and reset it will maintain turn on condition i hope you understood this and you enjoyed this video so guys please do like comment and share thanks for watching